think the problem was that I loved the music more than I loved money at the time. So I didn't work for money. I, I worked for the music. A lot of what we all do today is due to uh, people like John Morales. He's the first one to really make, um, you know, disco grooves go further and further and further. He's the reason why dance music was created, you know. He's a part of that generation. I love delivering the message. It's like a priest in church. In a way, I think that the DJ is the priest of the club. He goes and he preaches with his music to the people there. And at the end of the night, just like in a church, the people get up, they say hello to the priest at the end, and they walk out. And hopefully they walk out smiling with a good feeling. I've been in some dark places during my life, and the music helped drag me out because it made me realize how important it was. And that if I kept down some of these roads I was going, that I would lose it. I remember times where I couldn't afford to pay the gas or the electric and the lights would get turned off and I had no water, you know. But meanwhile, I would sit in my living room and I would see these gold records on the wall. I would be out there in a fucking cane, in a wheelchair, on a fucking respirator, just playing tunes for people. I've always done it for the love of the music. I've never done it for any other reason. The more I want, the more I get. The more I want, the more I get.